Jennifer Lopez was seen partying with friends on Thursday, August 15th, the same day as her husband Ben Affleck's birthday. Jennifer posted Instagram photos from a night out with pals, showing that she was sitting on stage left during Bruno Mars's unbelievable two-hour performance at the Intuit Dome, a new venue in Los Angeles. Longtime manager Benny Medina was also there, and she captioned the images with about last night. Instead of walking the red carpet, the 55-year-old partied with pals in a pair of baggy pants, a white crop top, and big spectacles. Jennifer did briefly lay eyes on her 52-year-old husband, Ben, earlier in the day, as she stepped out of his Pacific Palisades neighborhood house that he had just bought. Others that paid Ben a visit were his three children's mothers and his ex-wife, Jennifer Garner. Without Ben by her side, Jennifer Lopez celebrated her 55th birthday in July in the Hamptons with pals. The $68 million property that Jen and Ben own is now on the market, while Ben bought his own house in July. According to reports, the couple's two-year marriage is in trouble. They eloped in July 2022 after reuniting in 2021, over two decades after breaking off their previous engagement. About a month later, they had a huge wedding celebration in Georgia to rejoice with their loved ones. Ben spent his second wedding anniversary in Los Angeles, while Jennifer spent it in the Hamptons, and the couple chose not to publicly celebrate. Taking time off to be with her children, family, and close friends was the reason given by Live Nation when Jennifer announced the cancellation of her Globe Tour. At the first event at the brand new venue in Inglewood, Los Angeles, Jennifer was seen walking the red carpet among celebrities such as Angela Bassett, Megan Trainer, Sophia Bush, Kelsey Ballerini, and Chase Stokes. The local basketball club, the Los Angeles Clippers, have moved their home game to Intuit Dome. The opening night festivities started with a ribbon-cutting ceremony and ended with a spectacular performance by Bruno Mars. During the encore, Mars was joined by Lady Gaga, who debuted their new single, Die With A Smile, 